<laughs> Today I learned that only 20 people have been boiled alive in Yellowstone National Park. But with your help, we can change that. For just a small monthly donation, you can help us sacrifice the tourists to Old Faithful every single day. Is that... is that butter? No, it's Stonehenge. <gasps> I can't believe it's not butter. I'm so done with this site. Snom, how powerful are you? I'm not able to answer that for legal reasons. The mug root beer dog looks like a rant sona. This dog is about to call someone a snowflake. Guarantee it. Writing prompt. Two magicians made an oath when they were children that they would never harm each other. Now they are mortal enemies and have resorted to inconveniencing and annoying each other. Knowing if they harm one another, they'll die. I want to watch the show so bad. European culture is just hating all other European nations. Like, yeah, we're at peace, we're cooperating, no tensions or anything. But if I ever have to talk to a goddamn Belgian... Waffles are greater than windmills. I will annex you! Why does the periodic table just look like a bunch of pronouns? New pronouns just dropped, get them while they're hot! Oh, snap, I always wanted to be Mercury. All right. Can you describe the culprit using this pit crew creator? Sometimes it's annoying when your character can't jump in a video game. But how often do you jump in real life? Do you even remember the last time you jumped is a question I never anticipated leaving me feeling so hollow and terrified? A scaleless snake. They're scaleless as a result of mutation. I feel like I'm seeing something that I shouldn't have the ability to perceive. He nakey. Loo noodle. A loodle, if you will. He looks like the snake-shaped sphinx cat. <laughs> he kind of does. Why do people in D&D each occupy a five foot by five foot square? How far apart do you think people need to be? Why are the D&D minis afraid of touching? Those are bold words for someone in stabbing range. These posts match each other so perfectly I thought they were the same post at first. Today I learned that dogs, cats, and other carnivores have taste buds specifically tuned for water. But humans don't. And can't taste water. What are they tasting in toilets and puddles that we can't? First we were denied shrimp colors and now this?! Gender is a coin that everyone said was gonna land on heads or tails, but I turned mine into one of those pressed pennies from the museum. It's got a dinosaur on it. I love it. Shout out to every fast food employee who has offered to make my order a slightly different way just so it comes out cheaper. Yeah, can I get a 20-piece McNugget? Yeah, can I get a 20-piece nugget? We're actually having a BOGO deal on 10-piece nuggets. Would you like to do two of those? Yes, and I'm going to kiss you on the mouth when I get to the window. Please. Stop adding there are two kinds of people, and that escalated quickly to text posts. There are two kinds of rapid escalation. Well, that people twice, Lee. What the fuck kind of turtle is that? Science of Tumblr, can you please explain this? <clears throat> Mitochondria. Thank you, Science Side. <clears throat> comfy. Fish, no! But comfy. Fish, please, you can get hurt! Ah, uh, so sleepy. FISH no! You know what? Skyrim was right. Tomato soup does restore 10 HP. Well, no. Writing prompt. You have the power to heal others. And yet, you are a villain. Oh, I'm the American healthcare system. Okay. I know antipasto means appetizer, but I still like to believe that it refers to the pasta's arch nemesis. You ever see something and think, wow, that is violently American? Oh, do you mean like the glazed donut bacon cheeseburgers? Exactly. What is that? Why do stores always say gifts for her? Who is she? Why are billions of Americans being encouraged to buy gifts for this entity? Someone explain. We must appease her. Cartoons? Isn't that for kids? I look up and smile. Yes, it is. Suddenly my appearance shifts and shrinks as I become a child. All my money turns to Monopoly money and all my bills are gone. My adult responsibilities vanish. Finally, the spell is broken. And I am free. Yeah, libraries are cool and all, but have you ever found a library with a secret doorway disguised as a bookshelf that leads to a smaller hidden library filled with ancient books full of mysteries and forgotten knowledge? Me neither, and I'm sad about it. Biology says I'm 70% water. Chemistry says I'm 99% hydrogen, oxygen, carbogen, and nitrogen. Physics say I'm 99.9% .9 empty space, and psychology says I'm 100% confused! 
Which is it? A blonde guy with a magic hammer goes after his colleague, a big dude with giant fists and an anger management problem. Teams up with a fierce female fighter with a tragic past, all while trying to navigate a strange, colorful world forever locked in by a sensationalized competition and run by an old man with a flamboyant demeanor. Along the way, he runs into a disgraced royal heir with a penchant for green and mischief. Is the movie Thor Ragnarok or Wreck-It Ralph? So, this gave me chronic whiplash. Enjoy! God damn it, I'm so funny on a daily basis, and the world just misses my genius banter! Hey guys, I don't know how to tell you this, but apparently Mozart is the original cat boy. Less well known, however, is that Mozart liked to imitate a cat. He'd be rehearsing an opera with his singers, where he'd suddenly grow bored and leap over tables and chairs, meowing and turning somersaults. He even stop! I heard enough! Mozart is the one true cat boy. Behold, a moose raised from Bebe and used by this Canadian in his logging business. The moose leaves for a few weeks in the spring, but always returns. You know, you can try and make fun of Canada all you want. But we know you're only doing it out of jealousy, because Canada is awesome! One of the worst feelings is when you feel a hyperfixation slipping. Like, no, you're so sexy, please keep giving me the happy chemical! Me, sees the number 69. That's, that's the sex number, holy shit, nice! Sees the number 420. <laughs> that's the weed number, look at that shit! Nice! Sees the number 666. Ah! Woo! Okay. Time to work. Okay. Okay, let's get started. Yeah, let's do this. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yes, sir. Let's do this. Let's get started. Just gonna start now. Yep. Okay. 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 All right. Okay. Right. <laughs> May I present to you the soft cabinet? No. Unpresented, please! Today I learned while in college, the writer of Night at the Museum would regularly visit museums while high on acid. Yeah, that... that makes sense. I'm a writer. I whisper, as I spend several hours watching YouTube with a Word document up, making no effort to actually write. If I was rich, I'd hire a harem of clowns to chill in my mansion and do clown stuff. The fact you use the word harem to describe a group of clowns is extremely worrying to me. I know what I said. Me, running after garbage truck. Wait, you forgot me! I'm Anxiety. Anxiety the Hedgehog. It, is there any context to this? No. I don't like to call Frankenstein's creation a monster because he seems pretty chill, so I just call him Frankenstein's little boy. Yeah, that's just Frankie's kid. What's it to you? Yeah, that's Frankie's kid. His pop don't treat him right. Neither do most of the people around here, but he ain't a bad kid. Just in a bad situation, you know what I mean? C can we have this? Hey, start referring to things you own as your inventory. Jackie, did I give you my keys? I don't know, let me check my inventory. Yeah, mom, hold on one second, I just need to equip my shoes. Hey, you wanna go downtown? I can conjure an Uber. I think it's important to bear in mind that complex doesn't necessarily mean nuanced. A thing can be complicated, and also very, very stupid as hell. The file 267-2009-03-3109-1115 utc.dpeg is a system file. If you remove it, Windows or another program may no longer work correctly. Are you sure you want to permanently delete it? I'm just trying to clear up my hard drive. What is this bullshit? Nah, the load bearing silver the hedgehog JPEG. I mean, he carried all of Sonic 06. MLM is just WLW upside down, and WLW is just MLM upside down. I don't know what this means. I think it means we're friends. Oh, I see the confusion. It's just referring to being switched to Wumbo. You know, Wumbo. An antonym for the word many, often learned in first grade. The study of Wumbo is also known as Wombology. Behold the Grand Wizard and his young apprentice. These guys kind of look like some Zelda merchant that sells you artichokes and pumpkins, respectively. I mean, they do. Like, no offense to my friends and family, but if I had a chance to abandon this timeline for a medieval fantasy land, I would absolutely do it. Goodbye, student loans and depression. Hello, cool magic shit and most likely an early death by the sword. As it should be. Have fun shitting in outhouses and losing loved ones to the plague, trademark. I said medieval fantasy, not actual medieval times, you impudent fool. All right, have fun crapping in outhouses and losing to loved ones to the goblin raiders, trademark. That's more the fuck like it. Woo, okay. Time to work. Okay. Okay, let's get started. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, yep, okay. 
Yes, sir, let's do this. Let's get started. Just gonna start now. Yep. Okay. 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 All right. Okay. Right. <laughs> Frequently bought together. Do not separate them. Ah, oh, the start of Pokemon in Ohio. Never stop collecting little things to make you happy. Rocks, buttons, feathers, flowers, sticks, bugs, bones. Never stop. How did a crow get a Tumblr? With his fucking email and password, how'd you get here? Think about jelly-filled donuts. <sighs> Fuck yeah. You have amazing taste in food. Jelly-filled donuts are great and are my favorite, actually. Nothing beats a jelly-filled donut. You're right! Jelly-filled donuts are simply the best. The, the, those aren't jelly-filled donuts. Please stop. Love me a good jelly-filled donut! Mm, simply the best! The timeline is collapsing. Do not question any further, please! Nothing beats a jelly! <laughs> <laughs>